What's up guys? So as some of you may know, we moved into an Airstream. Um, I'm gonna give you a walkthrough of what it looks like so far. All right, so first and foremost, um, Airstreams are really a small space. We live in a 25 foot Airstream. Um, it's a flying cloud edition, if anybody wants to know. The way that it's set up is there is a kitchenette in the front of the, um, I was gonna say house, Airstream. Then the kitchen is there, um, like in the hallway kind of. And then from there, we've got a uh, toilet on this side, shower on this side, and then bedroom all the way in the back. So let's start from the beginning. So our dinette is right here. It has um, a small seating area on this side, and then it has a bigger seating area on this side. Um, it's the length of the um, kind of like seating area around here and then the dinette actually folds down so that you can um, Use it as an extra bed or maybe like a couch kind of situation. So we have it folded up right now um, We haven't actually folded it down yet. So stay tuned. That will be its own thing. as for our kitchen we have um, a full sink it has a cover on it because um, counter space is pretty limited around here so this gives us a little bit more counter space then we've got a um, gas top stove and a full oven um, this is a uh, gate for Mila it didn't work shocker and then with the oven and stove we also do have a microwave and a full fridge and freezer so it's pretty cool. We can basically cook everything that we would need in here, minus my air fryer that sadly had to go. In terms of storage, um, these were designed really, really well, and there's no space that's not utilized. So in the dinette area, these are two storage spaces. We've got a bunch of stuff in both of those. We're still kind of trying to figure out how to maximize the space um, because we got rid of a lot of things in anticipation for not being able to fit it all. And we actually have a lot more space than we thought in terms of storage. We've got kind of like storage stuff like um, Ziploc bags and then we've got our cutlery and then we have a junk drawer in the bottom. You don't need to see that, it's not very exciting. We've got some more storage up here on both sides. And then next to the fridge, there's a really small space, and this is a really great pantry. So we've got spices, all the good stuff in there, and those racks can be adjusted, so you can always move them up and down, which is kind of cool. And then we have a little smaller space up here. Shout out our X-Bars. Then um, we go into the hallway, getting towards bathroom and bedroom. Now with the bathroom, um, they split it up. So there is a toilet and full sink in here, and then there's a shower on this side. So with the bathroom, our bathroom area has a full toilet, sink. Um, there's only one small mirror right now. So we're working on figuring out where we can put another mirror in here so that when we move, it won't run the risk of getting destroyed. But we do have a lot of storage in here as well. So we have under the sink, we have um, where our toilet roll is. And then we also have another kind of cabinet. I just jammed my finger, that hurt. Um, and then the shower is on this side and it latches shut so that when you're moving, the doors won't open and you unlatch it because we're it's pretty stationary right now. And then this is our shower, full shower. I actually fit perfectly in here with space above my head. And uh, this is a nicer shower than the last place we lived. So I'm pretty happy. Moving on to our bedroom. So this is kind of a funny space because it's pretty small. Um, the way that the bed is set up is it's in the corner. So the bed faces one side of the Airstream instead of facing, um, or the feet of the bed facing out. Um, so it makes my side of the bed a little tricky to get into, but it's all good. And then we have the same storage up top. And then we've got drawers and one more closet here where we can hang some things. We also do have a TV in here. Um, we don't really use it because we don't watch TV in bed, but it came with it, so 
you win some, you lose some. And then we do have a thermostat because um, we have central air and heat, which is pretty cool because that gives us a lot of um, opportunity of where we can take the airstream and not worry about freezing or sweating. Um, so that is the big tour. I'm going to film something soon about cooking in the airstream.